everyone, I've got a little haul video to share with you today. And the first thing I got was this doll. She was described as a Madame Alexander doll, and I don't know whether she is or not. She came in the nude, so I've dressed her in what I had that fitted her. She's wearing 17-inch Arna's boots, because they're the only ones I had that would fit her. Her feet are quite... well, they're the, in proportion with her body, so they're... because she's about a 15 and a half inch doll. But she's got articulated toes, ankle, knee. She has articulation in her wrist elbow and at the top of her arm which is brilliant on her back it says alexander 2003 and underneath that there is a number 01 either 97 or 47 i can't work out make out what it says so if anybody knows anything about her i'd be really grateful Next I got this girl. This is a, a Hawaii Hawaii I can't say it. Hawaii skipper. Hawaii skipper Barbie. As far as I know, she's from 1999. She's the first skipper I have ever owned. I've never had a skipper before, I don't believe anyway. She's got nice long hair that comes down just to her bottom. She's wearing a little bikini and she has on no shoes. But she was lovely. She was £5, which I thought was an absolute bargain. I didn't want to leave her at that price. Then I got these two dolls. They were they were £12. So £6 each. £6 per body. And I've got them to articulate my fashionistas with because they are very well articulated. The princess. They're the princess dolls. I've got a Snow White and I've got um, a Merida, which are a bit different in skin tone and they're, they're very well articulated they're articulated at the elbow at the wrist at the knee and at the ankle and six pounds is a good price to pay for an articulated doll in my opinion so that was those two and they are going to articulate some of my fashionistas i also wanted to show you a couple of dolly updates so i got this girl she i got her in a in a bundle the other day and I thought she was a fashionista but I haven't actually figured out at which one she is yet but I've popped her on a dress and some shoes and she'll go with my other fashionistas until I find out who she is it says 2013 Mattel on her so maybe she isn't a fashionista and also I keep forgetting to show you my Noli night on the town doll I've had my Noli for a while but I didn't have her outfit and Katie very kindly popped the outfit in with the boots for her because she saw that I had her and she popped it in with um, an absolutely wonderful parcel that she sent me. It was so kind of her. So Katie, yes, there, there finally is Noli in her dress. I did put it on her straight away. I, I've just had her up there on display and it wasn't until the wind blew her off the shelf that I thought... I must put her in a video to show her. Yeah, she's beautiful though, isn't she? She really is. And she looks even more beautiful with her outfit on. So thank you again for that, Katie. She looks gorgeous in it. Then I have a couple of more fashionistas who I have articulated. There's this girl who's got the chewed hand, but nobody's going to notice that on her, are they? I got this Barbie, I think, from the car boot for 50p, the body. So, and it suits her really well. And I really wanted to articulate this one. I really love her. So yeah, that's her articulated. And then the other one that I did with the car boot Barbie was this girl. She matches that skin tone. It matches her almost perfectly. So yeah, she got that body and, and her shoes and everything fit it really well. She actually is a tall and she's floral flare, she's called, and I've called her blue. She's actually got blue shoes on, so that's probably why I called her blue. I'm as bad as the, as the uh, Barbie people, aren't I? This is Poppy. This is my Poppy. And she's, um, I called her Poppy because she's pineapple pop, number 70. Yeah, I'm as bad as the fashionista people, aren't I? <laughs> and then yesterday, my friend Jessie on... on 
on Facebook and in, who's in the Bratz Collectors group messaged me and said that she'd seen these trousers on eBay and they were a pound and she knew that I was missing them so that was really kind of her to do that so thank you very much for that Jessie and they came today I only ordered them yesterday and they came today I'm really happy to get those and I'll have to pop those on the doll and show her in a later video now the last thing I've got to show you is a huge a huge parcel this bag is absolutely full so first comes this I don't know what it's from JG I've no idea but it's a little locker a school locker we always need somewhere to store doll clothes so that that will come in handy for that it's got a little mirror in the top we've got this bag here which is full of food food related items there are plates there are little baskets there's even a bucket there there's a plate with some cake on it there's a wedding cake there some of it's barbie and some of it's brats there's some burgers there all that sort of thing there's a little that looks like a a nintendo game doesn't it but on the other side it looks a bit like a camera and if you look through the hole and press the button at the side you can actually see pokemon through the hole there's a bottle of coke there there's some flowers you can see it's absolutely full of all that sort of thing there are even um, some kebabs in there and some hot dogs <laughs> yeah it's full absolutely full then this which is a running machine a brat's running machine it's missing the handles i think i've got one of the handles but not two there's this trolley which might be a, like a hostess trolley thing i think that's probably a barbie one i don't know it doesn't say barbie on it so i could be wrong about that there's a barbie television there's this i've absolutely no idea what that is so if anybody knows please let me know i don't know whether it's shelves i don't know whether it's a roof for something i don't know what it is to be honest no idea there's two surfboards which i wanted to call skateboards they're not you wouldn't get very far trying to skate on them would you they're brats ones i believe there's that there's this bag which is full of things like perfume bottles hair dryers there's little um cups in there there's some glasses in there there's a little trophy in there there's a little brats car number plate there's a little case a tokyo go go case and there's a few Bratz bags and that I think belongs to the pirate, one of the pirate dolls. Little treasure chest. And there's also some brushes and things in there and there's some of these. I've no idea what these are but I think there's three of them. So if anybody knows please, it looks like something might rest on top of there but I'm not sure what. Then there's this huge bag of clothes. Most of them are Bratz clothes, but some of them are Barbie. So we'll have a look and I'll, I'll show you what is in there. So there's this one. I think that belongs to one of the Funk Out or Strut It girls. Jade, I think. This one, which I think is a treasures top. This little snake skin effect one with a gold trim this little pair of pants pair of undercrackers some trousers short cut off trousers they are for the girls lots of boys trousers in here so they'll come in very handy and they do smell as if they've been stored they yeah uh, they, they smell a bit fussy I, I, someone did comment on someone did comment on my video the other day that i have uh, <laughs> I'm funny because I sniff everything. I can't help myself. I do have to sniff it. Ugh, yes, and it does smell a little fusty, but they're not. Di none of it's dirty. It just has been stored, but they will all get washed because of that. 
and this has got this um, nice pattern on the front there's this very glorious dress which I think must belong to to a Barbie there's a cowboy or cowgirl hat some more boy trousers there's this which I'm not sure that's Bratz or whether it's a Barbie one it looks like a stole and I think it has a little muffler to go with it in here somewhere there's this which might be a pretty and punk top there's this bag which has seen better days and I don't think it'll survive the washing machine do you this little bag which I think is from one of the sports ones a little hat a winter hat this little bag with the butterflies on it I have seen that I think that's one of the formal funk ones this little bag with little circles on the front I don't think I've seen that before this boy's shirt I have seen that before I do like that it's good to get some boys clothes in a bundle this is um, I think it's Yasmin's tennis or football skirt one of the sports anyway there's salon and spa eye mask there's this dress I don't know who that belongs to whether it's a Barbie one or a Bratz one I don't know I don't know who it belongs to it, it seems to have shrunk a bit on the top there unless it's meant to be longer I don't know seen better days anyway that has there's a little Barbie shirt that ties at the front there is this tiny tiny little skirt and I have got some tiny tiny little dolls somewhere if I can find them I'll show you there's this winter scarf a feeling pretty scar uh, skirt not scarf a boy's top with the flames down the side I like that I don't think I had that a Tokyo go go I think it's Jade's top a little purple bag lots of stuff there is there's a pretty and punk Megan's jacket and skirt more boys trousers there just a plain pair of black ones I think this is class Yasmin skirt there's the little muffler that goes with the pink stole there's this orange sweatshirt I like that I really love that I might put that on one of my girl dolls I just really like it there's this little red bag I don't know where that's from that could be a Barbie one this little bag I wasn't sure if I had that you know because I think I was looking for that yeah I may not have had that there's bowling Megan's bag I don't think I had that either to be honest there's a little punk bag there that could be Megan's there's the funk and glow jacket there I think it must be Sasha's but it's not working it probably just needs new batteries because I have found with the brat stuff that um, if you put new batteries in nine out of ten times they do still work which is amazing these little white trousers I have seen those before but I can't remember who they're from there's Tokyo Go Go trousers which I think go with that top for Jade I think there's some boys flame shorts there's these trousers which I haven't seen before they could be Barbie can you see they've got like a pattern and it feel they feel velvety pajama bottoms a hat with pink um, pink and purple like flames on the front there might be strutted jades campfire Chloe's hat a little white top well it will be white when it's washed a little it says cowboy bag 
a little gold skirt which could belong to one of the fabulous Vegas girls. Another pair of girls trousers. A green and orange scarf. I've not seen that before so I don't know who that belongs to. This little top, one of the wintertime ones. A little sleep mask. I've seen that one before. Another pair of boys jeans. Very handy all these boys clothes are. A little pillow. A little black and gold bag. Very posh with little tassels on the front. This little bag that says pink on it. A little yellow towel, more boys jeans, a large blue, well, that could be a kid's purse you know, it's quite big isn't it? But I don't think it's Bratz, I think it probably is um, Barbies. There's another one of these tops, so there's two of those. Twin tops. <laughs> I haven't seen that top before. It says uh, Western on it. No, I've not seen that before. And there's this little boy's hat. I believe it's a boy's hat. Little pink shorts. A tiny, the tiniest of little dresses. A formal funk bag. A boy's blue top. Class Chloe's top. Another little bag there, little black one with a white string. Race car driving somebody's helmet. Whether it's Katia's. A wintertime jacket. And another wintertime jacket. And then what's left in there is a few odd shoes and like little bits and a few little bags. And I think that might be a welcome to fabulous top as well. And then there's that little belt there. And also came these tiny little dolls. Um, I have no idea who she is. She's obviously she's a magician because she's got a rabbit in a hat. But I, I don't know which magician she is or... So it says on the back of a 2000 China, it says. Uh, yeah, I have no idea. Then we got a Lil Bratz. I think she's Nazalia. Yeah, I think that's who she is. She's got green eyes. She may be, she may be Sasha. Then we got some tiny, this little tiny. She could be a Barbie. It says Mattel, yeah, Mattel China, it says on it. She's teeny, isn't she? She's got really long hair for the size of her and she's wearing like a little blue vest and pant set. Yeah, her hair's really long. If you took it down, I think it would come down past her knees. That was her. Then we've got this little teeny tiny baby. I don't think I've got one as small as this. Look how tiny it is. <laughs> got little pink pants on a cute little face. I uh, don't know what it says on its back though. It says China, Mattel. Um, I can't read the rest of it. I'm terrible. Yeah, no, I can't read that year on there. Something out, was it 02, 2002? Might have been 2002. Then there was this little baby, cute little one, look at that. He hasn't got anything on him, he, she. And she's got, yeah, she's quite nicely, she's like strung, she's not stiff, you know, she's quite wobbly. And then this one's the same, but she's a little blondie, or he, yeah. And then the dolls I got, the Bratz dolls I got, are in here with a few extra little bits. So we've got another shirt there. We've got Feeling Pretty Yasmin. 
I don't know whose top she's got on. I haven't seen that top before. I don't know whether it, it might be pyjamas because it's silky. Really pretty. I think that might be a formal funk or a girl's night out skirt. And they could be her her shoes, but I don't think they're the ones that go with the feeling pretty outfit. There's a salon and spa chair. There's a boy. He's a really nice looking boy, but he's had his hair cut so, so short. I suppose you could um, reroute that little bit, couldn't you? If you were that way inclined. Yeah. Then, strut, is it strut it? I think it's strut it jade. One of the it jades. Anyway, one of the earlier ones from 2003 she is. Style it, strut it, yeah. She needs a bit of a wash, but she's she's dressed. No shoes. There's not a lot of shoes in this bundle, but I do have plenty of shoes. And she's got a really badly marked blue hand there. Hopefully that'll come off. We've got salon and spa. Fiona in her outfit, I believe, even with the shoes. We've got another salon and spa stool. We've got this case. I don't know whose case that is. I don't think it's a Bratz one. It could be a Barbie one. We've got this, which I think goes on the walking machine, running machine does look like it would fit on there pretty well yeah there's a little bag there there's a little wash bag that you hang up and put all your washing facilities in washing accoutrements in it's even got a little hair dryer in there there's a till that probably goes with the salon and spa there's this I don't know what that is. It's a mirror, is it, do you think? It's very shimmery, but I don't know if it is a mirror because it's like, um, it's not reflective. Well, it is, but it's not, you can't see your reflection in it. I'm not sure about that. There's another one of these things. I don't know what they are. There's a chair. For, to have your hair dried and that can move up and down with this twisty bottom very handy another star brush a lilo that looks like a barbie one it says 2001 it might be a mcdonald's one it does say mcd corp hmm, could be there's a helmet more brushes, lots of brushes in there and little bits and bobs. There's a guitar in there. That guitar. Not sure where that's from. That could be one of the Bratz Girls guitars. And then the reason I bought the bundle was for Welcome to Fabulous Vegas Sasha, who's got her original trousers on. But she's also had, I think, a haircut. Yeah, which is a shame. But yeah, the whole bundle was £20. That's a Barbie top. It says Barbie on it. And I thought I got my money's worth there, didn't I? There is absolutely loads of stuff. I hope you enjoyed that. Thank you for watching. Bye for now.